on the Microsoft Access user interface that is on the screen, there were two main areas. The navigation pane, which is the storage area, it's on the left hand side of the of the screen. That's where you store and pick all the, uh, the information that you need, the content of the data. And this video shows you the command ribbon. That is the area across the screen. And the command ribbon is your toolbox. Imagine you are a carpenter. The command ribbon is where you store all your tools. Whereas the navigation pane is where you store all your materials. In the command ribbon, you have the label. You will learn about the create, label, report, query. And also it's important skill for students preparing for IGCSE, ICT exam. That's external data, import and export. Okay, now let me show you the real things directly on Microsoft Access. Okay, so this is the ribbon. Okay, follow my cursor. So this is the ribbon area. This is where you pick your tools to do your database work. First of all, this is the home area. This is where it's very similar to Word. This is where you um, pick the tools to edit the data. Another second area is create. You come here, this is starting point if you want to make a report or if you want to make a label or make a query. Now in IGCSE exam, query, label, report are the most important skills and every year is tested. So you should on your SS click here and read okay, the online instructions and tell you what each part is and it tell you what it does. You can pause my video now so that you have time to explore on your own. Just explore these three areas. One, the label and report. Okay, and the starting point to these three area is create. Now, you can pause the video and explore on your own now. Just explore create area. Now the next one, external data. This is also important area because if you know how to use these features, that save you a lot of typing. Imagine somebody give you a list of uh, like a, a school teacher give you a class list or school list of 10 classes each of the class has got 30 students so let's say we have 500 names in Excel and you want to convert that into database so that you can pick and choose the information to keep so how you how are you going to do it it's not practical or it's extremely time consuming to type them so therefore you must use external data in this area and in here they let you choose Okay, this let you choose from the data type of the original source. So go back to the school list example. Because it is in Excel file, therefore you click external file and then you come Excel. So you can then import from that Excel file. If the original form or original information is in simple text file, so you can just come here. Okay, so this is the ribbon, and under the ribbon you have one, two, three, four, five broad categories of features, and under external data you have import, 
and they also allow you to export whatever information you have in this database say in the case of the school or my dream class database I can convert it the database into Excel file so this is external data is one area you should look at and it allows you to import and export okay so this is the end of this recording about the command ribbons it's the toolbox of Microsoft Access and it allows you to create labels reports query and also import and export external data or import external data or export internal data okay this is the end of the recording